Yo, what is going on dudes, Chris here, and welcome back to another Minecraft video, and today we're playing some Minecraft Call of Duty on this server, if you guys want to check out the IP, I'll be down in the description below for you guys to check out and play, and today we have a nice little juicy topic to talk about, as you can tell the title of the video is like right up there, it's about the Google Plus, the most dumbest thing on this earth! Yes, it is. It's the most annoyingest thing, the most hated thing as of right now, according to YouTube, the people who are in this YouTube community. And even you guys, it involves everyone. And I know that this is going around everywhere, but I want to give my own thoughts and opinions concerning the fact that it involves me and involves everyone else on this YouTube community. So, Google Plus, in two words, I can tell you right now, it's stupid. And that's pretty much it. Just those two words describe everything about Google Plus is just stupid and dumb pretty much it and I tell you why because Google it's really it because apparently you know I, I let me just before I get into that it said like Google Plus has been asking me telling me that I have to connect my account my YouTube account to Google Plus and it's been doing that for like the past month or so already and it's been crazy because I keep canceling the crap out of it and the next day or the next few hours it would come back and say would you like to count you, your YouTube account to Google Plus and I would always say no why you gotta keep asking me and apparently a few days ago it told me that I have to connect my account to Google Plus but wait 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 it's okay if you don't have to connect your Google your YouTube account to Google Plus I mean it's completely fine you don't have to do that at all but you can't comment on the video you know you don't know, you can't comment so we want you to connect your account to Google Plus if you want to count, if you want to comment on a video, which it turns out I had to do it no matter and like I had to do it, and apparently whoever doesn't have a, their account connected can't comment on the video, which is really dumb in my opinion. And oh oh also since you have your connected to your Google Plus account, guess what you can do? You can use hashtags in the comment section if you want to do that. Like there is no Twitter, like there's no such thing as Twitter or Facebook. Because that's pretty much what they're trying to do. They're trying to be like Facebook and Twitter, which we already do have. Every YouTuber who... who like, there are many YouTubers out there that are huge, and they they have a Facebook and Twitter account for the YouTube channel, so why do we need a Google Plus account? That, that, that makes no sense, does it? No, 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 it doesn't. So, that's another thing. And also, if you want... So, you know how before we couldn't post um, links in the, in the comment section? Guess what you can do now? You can post links in the comment section. And you know what people can post those links about? They can link people, they can put bit.ly links and post them of pop-up scares, you know, those uh, pop-up scares that can scare the crap out of people and that shit traumatizes the crap out of me. It really does. And also, they can post up links of like, you know, probably like, you know, nudity stuff and stuff like that. And it's just ridiculous and it, they should have... I don't understand why they had to fix something that was never broken. The comment section wasn't broken, and now they are gonna continue. Now they just screwed it all up by including Google Plus into this YouTube thing, which it le should have left it optional in the first place because we don't we shouldn't be ha be forced to do something that we don't want to connect their account to. But it turns out we gotta do it if we want to comment on something. And also, I found out that I was I'm like going on I was going through my videos. I'm like. Wait, 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 why can't I reply to this comment? Oh, I'm sorry, you can't re reply to the comment apparently because, you know, Google Plus said so. I'm like, what? It, it, <laughs> I really, it's gonna be tough to cut, um, reply to comments. I reply to all comments and just like, I can already tell that how stupid it's gonna be for people to reply to comments, especially the big YouTubers. And especially like, people like PewDiePie, he actually disabled the comment section because of the reason why the reason why he disabled the comments was because he knew that the comments section is going to be filled with a whole bunch of links, promotions, and things like that. And that's why he decides to, like, cancel it because he knows what the, con the what will happen in the comments section. For example, the pop-up scares, the nudity websites, and stuff like that. And that's why he decides to do what he has to do. So I can ex really expect the big YouTubers to do that. They just got to bring back YouTube comments the old way like it was. Hashtag YouTube problems. Oh, dang, the game was over already. All right, we're going to hop into the next one. Right? Now, welcome back everyone, welcome back to the Call of Duty, we're playing Team Deathmatch on bootleg, and as I was saying before, hashtag YouTube problems, hashtag comments, and you can do all that stuff in the comment section below, because you know, it's Twitter apparently, I don't even know anymore, because they should have never, 
done this in the first place because it's gonna be a major problems for the big youtubers and like I already said all the reasons the viruses you know viruses nudity stuff like that and it's gonna be really for the people for the kids who are watching the video and if they click on that link they can be scared it can be you know traumatized by all what they what they're seeing and when they click the link and that's why that's what's gonna be a major problem for them and they gotta fix it as soon as possible because I can already tell what can be ha what's going to happen if they don't you know Everyone has their own say in this, and I want to see what you guys have to say for yourselves. I want you, if you guys can, reply in the comment section below. Let me know what you guys think, um, what you guys think about this whole Google Plus crazy nonsense in the comment section below. And I want, I can't, I can't reply to you directly because you know the whole comment thing. You know, doesn't let me, it doesn't allow me to reply directly to people in the comment section below. So just leave a comment. I'll read them, and I'll just, I'll somehow um, reply to you in a way. And if you want a direct, you know, I can't reply to you directly, but if you want a direct answer, you can follow me on Twitter and tweet at me, and I can tweet at you back and see what, you know, we can have a little conversation going on on Twitter. So, yeah, that's pretty much the crappiest thing on, you know, that whole bullcrap with the nonsense of Google Plus comments. And I just want to say why I think they're doing this is because they want more people, they want more people to make accounts on the website. They want to be big like Facebook be big like Twitter they just want to be big like everyone and you know in order to do that they gotta be like yo that's like pointing a freaking like gun in our face like yo give me the money or be like this is how this for them is like yo connect your accounts to Google Plus because before you can't comment in the comment section and it just <laughs> it's really dumb it's the stupidest thing that I can ever think of right now and that's why I want you guys to reply for yourselves and say what you guys have to think, what you guys have to say about it, because it does include you guys as well. Because, like I said, you wouldn't be able to comment if it weren't for Google Plus. You can thank them. Let's just let's clap for them for ruining the YouTube community, and hopefully they fix this as soon as possible because this is going to be a major problem in the future. And hopefully they'll catch on, eventually catch on, and they'll change it. So that's pretty much all I got to say about the. Oh, one more thing I forgot. YouTube, what Google Plus allows you to do now is that you can, if you have like your personal name, if you have your name out there, like your first and last name, and you connect it to Google Plus, guess what? People can see your first and last name, and sometimes people don't want that to be happening. I mean, you guys know my name, Chris, but I you know I don't feel like I don't think you guys need to know my last name though, and you know that's also a major thing because of privacy. And I remember back before YouTube had this little thing. If I can find the picture, I'll show it to you guys on screen right now. And, you know, it stated that, you know, we, they weren't going to allow us to, like, they weren't going to release personal information out, and they're right there, our name is being released. So hopefully you guys did enjoy this game of Call of Duty Team Deathmatch. That's pretty much all I have to say. Leave comments on what you guys think about Google+. I already ha had to say what I think about it. So, thanks so much for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed, and peace out. Have a beautiful day. Peace out, dudes.